Okay, so, um, he's never said, I don't know how I would really describe this song. Um, like, bluesy, country, dizzy, I don't freaking know. So, um, I'm gonna sing it for you right now. I'm so excited, I freaking love this song. Okay. He tells me I'm pretty like it's nothing. He tells me I'm smart like it's true. He tells me he's never met a girl like me in his life. How oh, when he means it. He tells me he's quit drinking since he met me. Cause I get him drunk in love with my eyes. He tells me that he's never felt so at home with someone until he met me. But he's never said I love you He tells me I'm crazy But he likes it He tells me I'm amazing And it scares him He tells me he'll do anything to make me happy That my smile warms him to his very soul he tells me he's quit drinking since he met me Because I get him drunk enough with my eyes He tells me he's never felt so at home With someone until he met me But he's never said I love you I tell him he's handsome cause it's true I tell him he's smart, I tell him I've never met a man like him And he tells me, oh he tells me he's quit drinking since he met me Cause I get him drunk enough with my eyes He tells me he's never felt so at home With someone until he met me But he's never said I love you No, he's never said I love you He's never said he tells me that he He's quit drinking since he met me Cause I get him drunk enough with my eyes He tells me he's never felt so at home With someone until he met me But he's never said I love you Okay, so as you can see in the top corner I forgot the date uh, I forgot what year it is Definitely thought it was 2016 Um stupid carry i'm 20 not 18 get it through your head um <laughs> um and then a lot of it you know i wrote most of this song to be honest and fuck it was gonna be shit it was gonna be one one way right and um i eventually just decided like that doesn't sound good i i was listening to like this Amy Winehouse, Ed Sheeran type instrumental on YouTube, and so I was writing along to it, but then I realized I don't like this instrumental, I actually quite hate it, but like, I liked the like, boppy, jazzy, bluesy, country feel that it had, and I was like, I really wish I had friends that could make this type of feel for me, and like, it would be good, because like, this song could actually go on YouTube and have, like, an actual video to it, of course, I'd have to find, like, actors and money and camera equipment and editing equipment, and, like, I don't have that kind of time, but, like, I really wish I did because, like, I feel like this song could be, like, yes, I love this song, um, the last song I felt like this about was, um, A Love Like This, and, you know, it was a little bit better um, to write than he's never said because, like, everything in a love like this I felt and I thought and I was true about, you know, that person that I was so in love with. But, and then, but he's never said it has been, I had to make a lot of stuff up and, like, what have I not heard on the radio that, you know, I could write and I could say and, um, um, that was really hard because I feel like a lot of my songs, they're already on the radio, but just better, better. And, um, so with He's Never Said, it was, you know, let's take things that this guy has actually said to me. Hey, what up? Um, like, 
he tells me I'm pretty every time he talks to me. Just like, it's nothing. He's just like, hey, you, you're really pretty. And I'm like, damn, you're sweeter than hell. You know, like, you're sweeter than ice cream. And I freaking love ice cream, so this could be a problem. Um, he tells me that I'm smart, that I, you know. And, I mean, he clearly doesn't know me very well because, let's be real, I'm not all that smart. Um, um, and he did tell me that he's never met a girl like me before in his life. And he just meant, like, he's never met a girl that writes country songs and posts videos on the internet and wants to be a country singer in her grown-up life, which I'm late for my life. And my sketchbook is just chilling and y'all can see like parts of it that's awkward um um he has not told me he's quit drinking in fact he's invited me to go drinking with him but like I don't drink so I feel like it would be the probably most romantic like I would marry a guy on the spot if they're like I quit drinking because your eyes get me drunk enough like you as a person who you are gets me drunk enough you know and I'd be like marry me we're married Yes. Um, um, and the whole feeling like feeling at home with somebody, I feel at home with a couple of people. And no one has ever in my life told me that, you know, they feel at home around me. Like I make them feel like home. So that was a big part of, I wanted to incorporate that feeling into the song. Um, he did tell me he'd do anything to make me happy. Um, that my smile is gorgeous, that it, makes his heart smile and I'm just like this is some cheesy shit right here um you know um that I'm amazing and not that he never said it scared him but regardless um you know I do tell him he's handsome I you know and that kind of scares people because handsome is such like an old-fashioned word you know, it's, you're cute, you're hot in this day and age. So when you say, like, you're handsome, I don't know. I I love that word. I love describing boys, men, whatever, guys like that. And ugh, he's so handsome. Very attractive. Um, He's very smart. He, you know, in a way I've never really, in, god damn it. Okay, that's worse. Um. <laughs> He's very smart in a way I've never really encountered before. Um, and I've never really met anyone like him before who, like, tries. Not once has he sent me a dick pic. Every guy I've been talking to him for, like, two months, every guy within the first week has sent me a dick pic. This guy never has. I'm very impressed. Um, so, I mean, the rest of the song is the chorus just a bunch of times again. And I love this song. I, I really want to send it to someone and be like, hey, can you put make a beat for this song and send it back and we can work together like that? And I just, I don't know who I would even work with for that. Like, who would I talk to? I have somebody that I would talk to, but like, it would be really awkward because it's my ex-boyfriend and he's like a music producer but like he does EDM and this is very much not EDM <laughs> and also it's not about him it's like about another guy so awk but like hit me up if someone knows a producer that's not my ex-boyfriend that could help me <laughs> thanks guys <laughs>